so this is a message to all the people from doctors of our country that in the current plight we are still fighting and we need support from all of you at this current time see we doctors we from the very beginning from the start of our career from the first year itself we have been dealing with the tough days in our first year we we have to touch the dead bodies we have to do dissections so from the very beginning we face tough times and we get eventually used to these tough times even after mbbs during internship we have spent like duties of 72 hours continuously staying in the hospital in whatever conditions we were given sometimes we used to sleep on the benches near the patient's bed or in whatever place we find during our duty hours many a times we skipped our breakfast we skipped our lunch and we have done only one meal a day so we have seen and we are used to these tough times but this which has happened in recent days is something which we cannot tolerate and i think nobody as a human being should tolerate or support the incidents this is not only about doctor security but this is about women security in our country we like uh, recently i have traveled outside country also for different studies and fellowships there also we have seen women roaming in the streets in night wearing uh, whatever clothes they wish but why this rape culture in our country is still prevailing like we cannot <clears throat> or we can say that there is something which is lacking in our security in our surveillance from the government side and the onus also lies on the bringing up bringing of the boys so it should be holistic approach to this uh, wrong thing which is going on and we should pledge to stop this so it should not only from the government side it should also come us from our side as a society and the incident which has happened should get justice we want justice everybody should cooperate and ask the government to give justice to the daughter of india and also provides enough security so that these type of things doesn't happen in future we are united like many a times we you would have seen doctors getting thrashed by patients relative or somebody unknown and uh, these things like go on unnoticed but this time we take a stand we want we urge everybody to take a stand not only for doctors but for women security recently i went outside and they said why this happens in india why is it like why is it like this on 15th of august one of my international friend asked me why is it that india is like this on the independence day i had no answer to give to him so this is something which is very shameful for our country i request from all the doctors community and as a indian citizen to our prime minister also to take the lead we cannot see you sitting silence during this time we need your support <clears throat> it's not only matter of west bengal it's a matter of national security as well as national uh, importance so we do not want our pm modi to stay silent on this he should also take a lead and i request to all the social uh, activists and all the celebrities all the uh, role models to whom we follow that they should come forward and help students and doctors to get the justice the justice should prevail thank you